Welcome back, get un unpacked, and take out your snack. Well, are you ready to rock? Ready to roll. All right, so we are in our final week of ELA. I had to take the mask off today because I want you to see me this last week. I have two more, two more ELA lessons, and I want to talk right now about title, setting, characters, author's purpose, and key details. That's what we're going to end this week off on, a strong review. Um, we remembered and we, we talked about the fact that a title is the name of a story. Characters are people or animals that are in a story. The setting is the place where the story is set. It could be in a kitchen. It could be on a city street. It could be on a patch of grass. It could be in a tree house. It could be in a school. It could be at McDonald's. Settings can be any place that you can imagine. Um, author. Who is, who is he or she? Well, an author's a person, um, and they're the ones that write the words in a story. Okay? Very important. The Pigeon Finds a Hot Dog. Words by Mo Willems. He is the author. The great author, one of my favorites. Um, and then it says, Shadows. And it just has the name Carolyn B. Otto. We know that that's the author. That's the person that wrote all these words. Now, pictures or illustrations are just that. They're pictures that people draw and write. And if you look, some people can draw some really nice illustrations so you get an understanding of how the character feels. The character's feelings can change. Um, they don't have to stay the same. They can feel one.